In 2108, humanity began colonizing the stars. Their reach would eventually span a vast region of space known as the Inner Sphere. During its golden age, under the governance of the Star League, the Inner Sphere experienced unprecedented peace, prosperity, and technological advancement. But with a great rise comes a great fall. Beset by greed and mistrust, humanity splintered. The Star League crumpled. Technological advancement slowed. The great houses, each vying for supremacy, turned on one another, engaging in a series of conflicts known as the Succession Wars. Amidst this chaos, mercenaries became the proxy forces for the great houses. Numerous battlefields sprung up across the inner sphere dominated by hulking war machines known as Battle Max. The year is now 3015, and these steel behemoths have become the tools of the mercenaries' trade. It's a lucrative time, yet one beset with perils of all kinds. Only the most skilled and brave among them will rise to become legend. Salvage crates at the last checkpoint were empty. Something's up if they're missing payments. This is Commander Mason of Major Campbell. Make a note. Looks like someone is gonna need a lesson in paying their bills on time. That's odd. What the hell? Commander Mason, I repeat, a massive invasion force is attacking the planet. Acknowledge. I have a visual. We need to take what we have and go. The fastest way is across the swamp. Captain, where are you going? It's possible they left the cash at the last checkpoint in the city. Let's get the money and run, Commander. This is reckless. We need to get back to base. They're distracted with the invasion. We'll be in and out before they know we're here. Let's hope it's not us they're after. Son, this is a ghost town. We're close. I can smell the sea bills. There's nothing here. Relax. We'll be out of here in no time. We're being tagged. Look out! Incoming airstrike! Captain Mason, what's your status? I'm fine, Commander. Left arm is offline is all. That was close. Return to base now. I am not leaving you behind. We were set up, and you're in no shape to fight. Meet me at the extraction point with the Leopard. Go! Now, Captain! Damn it. On the move. Commander, an enemy dropship is approaching your position. I've got eyes on. Identified. Hunchback and King Crab. Uh, damn it. Rihanna, any idea what these guys want? I picked up some chatter about coordinates of some kind. That mean anything to you? Coordinates? No, Rihanna. Promise me you won't leave without Jake. Promise me. Commander, I promise.
leave him here. We gotta get him support. Dad, we're coming. No, leave now. The Cavaliers need you. Commander, good to see you up. We haven't really had a chance to speak since your father was killed. I'm not much for sentimentality, but I worked with your father for a long time. He was a good man. Hell, he sacrificed his life to save ours. I don't know what's going to happen next, but whatever it is, I'd like to be part of it. I'd like to stay on as your ops commander. That is, if you'll have me. You kidding me? Your family, Rihanna. Or as close as I have now. Besides, I'm gonna need you. Yes. I suspect you will. About our Citrep, it's not great news. Those bastards that came after us are in the process of setting up a blockade of the system. Which means we're going to be trapped here with a tightening noose around our necks unless we do something about it. Who are these guys? Another mercenary outfit, by the looks of it. I don't know more than that at the moment. And these coordinates they were looking for? Not a clue, but we're going to find out. First things first, we need transport out of the system. That means a jump ship. I sent out a transmission right after the attack through the HPG. The message was for a longtime client of your father's and an old friend of mine. Name is Spears. He has powerful connections. I'm hoping he can help us out. Until I hear back from him, there's nothing we can do except lay low. In the meantime, Fahad wants to see you down in the hangar. The Centurion needs repairs and he wants to discuss them with you. I'll let you know when I hear back from Spears. Copy that. Hey, mate. Figured you'd want an update on the Centurion. Took a bloody beating back there, so fair warning. It's gonna be a while before she's operational again. Means you're gonna have to get comfortable with the light mech over in Bay 1 for now. She's a good girl. Won't let you down, you treat her, right? I'll do my best. Yeah, heard that before. Anyways, you know the drill. Access the repair terminal here. Once you're done, I'll get started on the work, eh? Hey, Commander. I've received a transmission from Spears in response to my request for help. Take a listen. Rihanna, I received your message. 
I'm sorry to hear about Nikolai. He was a good man and an even better pilot. He'll be sorely missed. I assume his son will be taking over the operation. Nikolai was always bragging about the boy's skills. Well, I hope he was right. I've begun working on a plan to get you safe passage out of the system, but it's going to take a little time. I expect you already know by now that whoever attacked you has set up a blockade to prevent your escape. It's a large system, though, so we can use that to our advantage. As soon as you receive this, I want you to proceed to the outermost planet in the system. It's a little more than a hunk of ice with a few leftover mining operations on it. There's an abandoned power station there. Now, I've got it on good authority that local raiders are using it as a secret cache for their ill-gotten goods. I know you can use supplies and materials for your repairs, and I expect you'll find what you need at that location. I've attached the exact coordinates to this message. Once I have a proper plan in place, I'll contact you again. For now, be safe. All right, time to suit up, Commander. I've already input the coordinates. All I need is for you to sign off and get us there. Understood. station is located on the other side of the ridge. You should be able to make your way through the pass undetected. That javelin you're piloting is lightly armed, Commander, but what it lacks in firepower and armor... It 
mix up in speed and mobility. I'm sure you wish the Centurion was repaired and ready to go. For this particular mission, though, the Javelin is the mech best suited for the job. And hey, it has jump jets. They could come in handy. Good try, Rihanna, but I'd still rather have a Centurion. Well, can't blame a girl for trying. these raiders is derelict commander but you can bet its perimeter defenses won't be my guess the raiders will have turrets stationed around the perimeter if that's the case it means they must have a generator close by find and destroy that generator before assaulting the plant and you'll have a much easier time of it got it thanks Acquired. Heads up, Commander. I'm detecting enemy units up ahead. Could be a radar patrol. Copy. Target destroyed. Target acquired. Okay, there's a geothermal power plant up ahead. There's a number of storage buildings in and around the plant itself. I suspect that's where they're storing their loot. Time to smash and grab, Commander. Once you locate a storage crate, more keep a pickup, then move on to the next building. From my initial scans of the site, I've marked where I think the crates could be located. Look there first. Destroy. Roger that. Good work. 
Marks for pickup. Commander, it appears that derelict plant has a network of backup generators running. Destroy them if you can. Dominic destroyed. Asset, move up to it, and we'll begin the recovery procedure. Good work, Commander. That's the last of their power generators. Target acquired. Target destroyed. should do it. Go ahead and meet me at the exfiltration point. If you see anything worth blowing up on your way out, say a weapons depot or something, I won't object. <laughs> Understood. Target destroyed.
acquired.
repairs to the Leopard and Centurion. You've made him a very happy man, though I doubt he'll admit it. Hey, boss man, that was quite the haul you brought back. Gonna make the repairs a bit easier now. But don't go getting stars in your eyes or nothing. I'm overworked as it is, and this shit needs a lot of loving, eh? So your Centurion is still gonna take plenty of time to fix. But yeah, like I said, nice job out there. Your old man will be proud. Now if there's nothing else, gonna get back at it, all right? Lot of work to do. Story of my life. <laughs> 